Hi, uh, my name is Diane and I'm making this video to show uh, people that they can heal their depression and for some doctor to tell you that um, you will have this for the rest of your life, there's no cure. That's not true because I am living proof that you can heal your depression. Um, in 2012, um, I, I couldn't take it anymore. And I said, there's gotta be something I can do something better. And, um, so I went to a bookstore and looked in the self-help section. And then I found some CDs, um, that I could listen to. And so my first CD that I ever got was, uh, from Louise Hay, you can heal your life. And I would listen to that every day to and from wherever I went in my car. Um, my depression um, was pretty bad. I, I was diagnosed as bipolar. Um, I had a lot of ups and downs, very depressed, wanted to die, didn't want to live, um, but I had to do something. Um, so... In um, listening to Louise Hay every day, um, things started changing. And it took like a few months before I started to notice um, uh, things that were changing. Um, what you need, what is needed to be done is to have a positive uh, outlook in life. And I was all doom and gloom all the time. Um, I never felt like anything was, I did anything right. I didn't feel worthy. Um, I, it, it, I, I just didn't want to live anymore, but, um, I know that my children, um, see the change in me, um, and they've noticed, uh, so then, um, after Louise Hay, there's this ladder. I started doing um, different stuff, um, going from one self-help book to another, self-help uh, CDs to another, and I did not watch the news. I did not watch anything negative. I tried to stay positive as much as possible, and every month I, I, I was noticing changes in me um, and I wasn't feeling depressed all the time. I wasn't feeling that cloud over my head or the, the weepiness and the sleeping. I mean, I slept a lot, um, during depression because that's the only time I felt good was when I was sleeping. Um, so I, like I said, um, it's, it's a lot of work. You can't just, uh, listen to one CD for a month and then think that that's going to help. No, you have to keep on it. You have to keep being positive. You have to keep um, working at it. You can't just um, think that your your life is going to change just like that. Um, it took a while uh, to um, be free of depression where I, I ha don't take medication and it's been since 2012, um, like I had depression most of my life, I think in my teenage years, all the way till I was in my forties or fifties. I, I, I don't know. I have to do the math. Um, but, um, it's been a journey and my family, um, I, they appreciate everything I've done and I have noticed changes in them too, changing to be more positive I, I guess because either I rub off on them or they see that I'm, uh, I've changed it. So they see the futility, no, not futility, the, the, the good, uh, of being positive. Um, I've been wanting to do this for a long time, uh, put a video out there to give people hope that they can heal themselves from depression um, and then, um, going all these years, um, I started doing meditations. I started, 
um, anything to do with um, spiritual or um, uh, is uh, helped me a lot. Um, um, probably have to. Not a very good uh, talker, so um, doing my best. Um, but like I said, I want to give at least I mean even if it was one person hope that they can heal their depression I've tried to help people before but um it's like they don't they can't believe that just being positive or listening to a cd or something like that will would work so they didn't even try it I mean you really gotta want this you gotta want to be happy and now I I mean I am so happy I have um a beautiful family, beautiful house, um, a beautiful job. I love my job. Um, when I'm driving my car, I'm, I'm not that road rage person anymore. Um, it just one day it clicked and then I, I, I don't know what happened. It's just, I go and I drive and, um, it's, and I enjoy driving. I enjoy working. I enjoy being with my family. I enjoy, uh, being in my home or, uh, being with friends and I enjoy all those things now when before I just wanted to hide and be in bed and 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 not go anywhere and, and not have a life it was it was horrible and then the medication part of it I mean I was on all kinds of medications um you wouldn't believe uh at first they would start to work and then they didn't then um then they put me on something else and then and then there were times where I felt like a zombie and I, I couldn't function. And I mean, I, 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 that was a horrible, horrible life to live, to be on medications where you don't feel yourself and you feel like um, you're, you, you can't do anything or you can't think. Um, those pills make you uh, dumb you down, um, make you uh, not think and... Um, and that's not a way to live with that medication. I'm not saying that you don't need it or you shouldn't take it. By all means, you should take it if if um, you're still um, having depression. Um, because I know it does help. But um, there is hope that you can um, heal your depression. And like I said, I am living proof. And I just want people to know that you can do this. Just thank you so much. Have a good day.